Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Meena the Superwoman. Today's video is how to choose your earring based on the shape of your face. To determine the shape of your face, you, you just have to look at the mirror or take a selfie and check which is the widest part of your face. If you have a widest part on your forehead and tapering face, then you have an oval face cut like me. If you have a widest face on your cheek and it is round then you have a round face there are two different categories in a round shape one is proper round and one is heart so if you have a proper big cheeks and a round chin then you have a round face cut if you have a tapering chin that is edgier here then you have a heart face the third category is square face if your widest part is of the top and as well as the jawline, if both are equal, then you have a square face. It is very important to determine the shape of your face and go for the right jewelry. You can match different accessories which are the imitation, but you can be careful when you are choosing some of the gold jewelry. Though fashion has no rules to it, it is always better to know the face cut and to go for the right jewelry. With no further delay, let's go into the video. Oval face shape has a widest forehead. So this has a versatile face shape for any earring. Most flattering are studs, buttons, hoops and drops. Round face is something which has a widest cheek area. So since it is already round and full, you have to add something which makes your face edgier. Go for some geometric shapes and studs with some danglings and some dangling edgier shapes. If you prefer to go for something big, then always choose something that tapers from the small to big that is minimal at the top and heavier at the bottom. Avoid earrings that are circular and similar to your face type. Avoid big buttons which is not which is going to give more attention on your cheeks. And the chanbali types are the perfect ones for the round face. Square face is something who have a widest forehead and the cheekbone. So to keep the weight away from the jawline, always go something which is widest on the top and tapers down towards the bottom. That is heavier on top and minimal at the bottom. This gives a very neat and stylish look for the square face like this. I hope you enjoyed this video and it was a very informative video. If you like this video, please share it with your friends who are struggling to get a right jewelry for them. With, if you have not subscribed to my channel yet, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you like my content, don't forget to give me a hearty thumbs up because it means a lot to me. And thanks for watching my video. Take care. Bye.